Hello YouTubers. Uh, today I would like to show you what is it? Today I will show you the Canduino. Uh, Canduino is kind of the spaceship. Uh, maybe not the spaceship, it's rather the stratospheric ship. Uh, it means that this 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 kind of the electronics and the shield can fly in the stratosphere on the balloon. Uh, it's uh, it's the Kansas uh, standard. It means that all of elements must be uh, in the size of the can with the some the liquid, soda liquid, as you see, and the weight of this should be not bigger than 300 grams. And this is it. And normally you can launch this uh, by the rockets or you can launch it by, by the balloon. Or here you can just connect the, the line with the parachute and to the balloon and then it can fly something like four, 40 kilometers above the ground. Uh, what we have inside? Uh, generally, uh, it's the skeleton uh, is just for mounting all of the equipments like the computer, sensors and this is very important that all of elements inside are in the Arduino standard. It means that uh, here you can just mount the Arduino computer and some Arduino sensors, uh, something like that. Here Maybe I just get this. This is the Canduino which was in the stratospherics and it land in and it landed. Okay, uh, you can see some of the ground here, <laughs> so it's a little dirty. Uh, so here you see that there is the mm, the main computer. Uh, precisely, this is the Arduino Due. Uh, probably the fastest uh, Arduino computer and with the, m uh, with the biggest uh, volume of the memory, etc. So, uh, so I prefer this kind of the computer. Uh, under the computer we have the battery, it's 9 volt battery. And here we have the radio transmitter, is the radio transmitter based on the Chipcon uh, CC1000 uh, transmitter. This kind of the cable is the, the antenna. And here we have the switch on and off, which we can just switch on and off the power system. Uh, yeah, maybe you can see here there's the little diode inside this hole, and I just can when I switch on this diode starts lighting. You see it? Oh yes, there, there's, you see, there's the diode. Oh, off. On. Okay. Uh, what's next? Sensors. Uh, we have there here is the temperature and uh, humidity sensor. Uh, next we have the, mm, there's here here you see this here I just put uh, the sensor it's the multi-sensor uh, GUI uh, mm, 80 and uh, on this sensor you have the temperature pressure sensor gyroscope uh, uh, accelerometer uh, and magnetometer uh, so a lot of sensors there's here we have the SD card uh, holder and you see that there is the micro SD card and there is the GPS just for the localization and generally uh, as you see that this platform is absolutely open, so you can just connect any kind of the sensor uh, to to this board. 
we're using just this this typical uh, gold pin cables uh, so it's easy to just changing the configuration and uh, if you're just putting um, the sensors you just can mount this on this bridge this elements we're just calling the bridge yeah, okay and this equipment as i told you before can fly into stratosphere can transmit data using the radio systems this data you can just receive uh, uh, using cheap uh, tv on usb receiver uh, with the special software name software defined radio it's the hacking software with hacking drivers uh, and then we change this chip receiver to a very high quality radio and uh, and this is it and using this we can just fly in the stratosphere so it's amazing okay so thank you for this short presentation and I would like to introduce you to just watch next movies when we just start to talking with tutorials how to assemble it, how to program it, and how to launch into the stratosphere. See you. Bye bye.